guys and welcome back to another episode of Star Ocean Second Evolution R. Now, last episode we got Celine in our party and we were told to go this way, so that's where we're going. I can't remember if the green dots are down or what they are. Oh, well, just run around. But fine, let's fight one. We can win Are these just gonna be the... Oh yeah, they are the weaklings. Good to know. Okay, now we run to this green dot over here. Is this a dungeon? Or what is it? Burke is a port town north of Crom. Okay, that must be the green dot up there. Mark. Hey, weren't we supposed to be going to Kurok? Oh, you're right. I think Kurok much farther north from here. Whoops. You think that ship at Kurok will wait for us? Probably not. Come on. Huh. All right. Headed? I know we're going to Curic, but where is are we? Man, I cannot think. I've played through this game multiple times, but I do not remember like anything. <laughs> the same enemy seems like a fight is in order enemies Punch. it's all well, over. i'd say that's yep right. still the same hey Markle. might be the first time i go on a ship that moves across water on lit cascade Waterfall beside Lake Cole that shines divinely in the sunlight, entrancing all who see it. They say some travelers even spend the whole day lost in its beauty. Look at that. Kind of back. Oh. Summons the goddess of fortune who offers the party of an item. I think I should hold on to that. We made it to cure it. Oh, not gonna give me a cutscene here at the start. Welcome to Curic. The ship is docked in the harbor right now. Okay. Here's the inn. Anyone in here? Yes, there is. Looking good. I think I'll go hit the town now. Oh, I can't go up here. Fine, I won't go up there. Um, there's a save point. Big fancy house, huh? Oh ho ho! A liar.
I can't go up here either, huh? Yeah, these damn people blocking their upstairs off for... How long has it been since the sorcery globe landed on Illyria? Eh, long enough. Billy's favorite. Welcome to my shop. I hope you'll be spending a lot. Let's see. Huh. Yeah, let's purchase this. All right. Thank you. Please come again. Hi. Um, no, I'm good. Yeah. Let's go up this way since it looks like a dead end. Romantic view. What a beautiful view. Ah, it takes me back when I was a man. Old lighthouse. Lighthouse that overlooks Kirik. The view from the top is said to be superb. But with the, inter the interior currently off limits, no one can verify if this is true. Lunar Telus. That looks like... You have this on right now, so... Let's see... Attack bubble increased by... Over hearing... to make a crafting all right here goes success flaring Yeah, let's do it again. Hey! Alright. So pretty. Time to check the equipment shop. Got all the latest weapon and armor. Take a look around. Speaker, speaker. I guess it's because she's got it equipped. You have to have an equipment. All right, let me go buy a rod real quick. Only 10 after all. Uh, let's see, customization, rod. Let's try it. Failure. Do it again.
It failed last time, that means it should work this- What? How did you change your rod into armor? I rod. Okay, thank you. Special oh. specialty customization <laughs> rod. Um Did it again. Let's try one more time and see if we can actually get a weapon upgrade. Not art. Customization. Rod. Ruby. Come on. I said one more, but I meant one more. Success. Come on. Oh. Shoot. Alright. You know, you suck. Well. This is weaker. Okay. I'm here. Turek's basically a tourist spot. The best way to enjoy it is take your time, like me! I can't afford more than this drink. I'm gonna drink it real slow. Hey, hurry up in there! <laughs> Can I talk to you? Oh, okay. Come in, come in, let me tell you your fortune. I'll have to keep what I saw to myself, but just remember to do your best at all times. Hey, you still got some ice cream on your mouth. Could you wipe it off for me, baby? Have you ever been to Cross Castle? The king will see anyone as long as they schedule an audience. Okay. Oh, treasure. Hey, food. That had an interesting flavor. I wonder where that dish is from. We use every ingredient and serve every dish known to mankind. Greens. Nothing go goes into our dishes except top quality ingredients and my top quality cooking. I really liked it, actually. You think the dish just isn't all that good, or you think the chef messed up? I'm having a hard time deciding whether I liked my meal or hated it. Finished bowl. can't make up my mind about what I want. Hello, Fred. Uh, hi. Hello. How do you like some delicious ice cream? Ooh, I could go for some ice cream. Please come again. Would you go inside the building? Oh, fashion. Welcome to the Trinity Shop in Olive Cross. We only sell the latest in high street fashion. Oh my god, you just have... You have so got to try a little harder with your fashion. Oh my god, can't you like see that I'm changing? No, I can't. You have the door open. Want some crates. Ooh. Let's see if there's any PA here. Yes, yes there is. Residents of Curric, you must leave this town at once. A great storm of destruction is on its way towards Curric at this very moment. That sounds fun. Claude, what's going on? Hey there, Reyna. This woman was just shouting some nonsense. I mean, I want to call it nonsense. She's claiming that Curric is about to be completely destroyed. And the only way to survive is to get out of town right now. Then maybe well, we should silly. listen. How could that possibly happen? What do you mean, how could it happen? There is still time to act. Please, you must begin evacuating at once. 
There is not much time left. I beg you. Please, you must believe me. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I mean, y'all can oh, die. Girl. She tried. Something must have gone loose in her head. Please, you must believe me. Sure, she just spent a little too much time at the bottle. The idea that the entire town could be destroyed is just too far-fetched to take seriously. I think that's true. If it is, the town's residents could be in serious danger. Okay. Let's see if there's another one. Oh. Nope. Okay. Normal mode it is. Hey kids, go play somewhere else, will ya? No fair! But we want to play here! Anu, that's a port town in L. I took a team up there once to investigate the sorcery globe. No one ever came back, though. I'm a bit worried about sailing on this ship. You getting on? I'll need to see a permit, please. Do you mean this? Well, I'll be damned. You actually got a real travel permit. Well, sure. Naturally, I don't know what that is. The king himself. Wow, I would have never guessed from the way you look. I'll screw you too. So when is this ship departing? Right now, get on. We'll be shoving off whenever they finish loading the cargo. Oh, not too long then. I can't be too sure of that. Tell you what. We'll wait up for you, so why don't you come back later? You know, poke around town a bit. I already did. Uh, okay. Now what? We have some free time before they depart. How about we have a seat on that bench and get some rest? A bench. Hey, you little shit. He just came out of nowhere. Are you all right, Reyna? Yeah, I'm fine. He just came out of nowhere. That was really rude of him. He could have at least apologized. Let me guess. Beef? Huh? What's wrong, Reyna? I can't find my wallet anywhere. Yeah. What? Are you serious? That kid must have stolen it. Time to kill him. I don't know. I might have dropped it. No somewhere. mercy. If that kid was behind it, we will definitely need to teach him a lesson. We need to find that kid first. What did he look like again? Blue hair. He was pretty small, and I think he had blue hair. Yep. That sounds about right to me. All right. Let's have a look around town. Can't go to hell without any money. Let's hurry up. Did he actually? Oh my god, he took all my money. Okay. Hey kids, do you? Isn't that Kettle? He's the one who's always playing by himself. Kettle usually playing by himself near the bar. Let's go murder a kid. Finally got you. What are you doing? Let me go. How about you giving us back the wallet you stole first? What? What are you talking about? I didn't steal no wallet. Yeah, you did. Really now? You better not be lying, Claude. It's okay if you don't know what we're talking about, but if you do know something about it, it would be really nice of you if you can tell us, okay? I'm sorry, no. I'm on Claude's side here. You know, if we don't have any money, then we'll be stuck here and we won't be able to continue our journey. You haven't seen any wallets lying around on the ground or anything, have you? Whoa, you're traveling? But you didn't have enough money in your... 
so it was you. Uh, uh. Don't scare him like that, Claude. No, Listen, he needs to be scared. You, okay? Just tell us what you were going to do with the money. Was there something you wanted to buy? I can get anything I want already. So why then? I just wanted to play a trick on you. Now we murder huh? him. Stab him. I'm not some sheltered rich kid, okay? I'm a big macho sailor and I can do anything I want. Guess I showed you, didn't I? So that's why you stole the wallet? Claude, stab him. Rain, I'll punch him in Nobody the face. Nobody ever wants to play with me. They think I'm too rich and stuck up to be with them. Oh, brother. Only well, let him on I fire. Understand. So, what are we going to do with this boy? How about we get our wallet back for starters? Here. I'm sorry. Now, what next? Burn him, Celine. I know. Why don't you guide us around Kurok until our ship departs? I promise we won't tell on you. Huh? We're new in town, so we'd like someone who knows this place well to show us around. You know what I mean? Good idea. I've already Bob. explored the town. Need I remind you about sparing the rod? So you want me to be your tour guide? Could you? Sure, I'll do it. It sounds like fun. My name's Reyna. What's yours? Kettle. And my name is Celine. And I'm Claude. Good to meet you. All right, off we go then. Burn him. Got it. Leave it to me. Did you feel that? Me? Not really. Oh, right. Hey, lady. Hey, lady. What is it, Kettle? They call this place Fountain Square. Bet you didn't know that. Well, wait till you hear this. Fountain Square is the busiest part of town. They've got a restaurant, a clothing store, and all kinds of other shops, too. Yep. Wow, how I visit nice. them all already. Do you play with your friends here, Kettle? Uh... Well, anyway, that's Fountain Square. Let's go hit up some of those shops. Sure. Love some crepes. Hey, Reyna, let's have some crepes. Sure. Thanks, guys. But, but I was gonna pay for them. Don't worry about it. In fact, consider it a treat for me. Thanks, Reyna. Mmm, it's delicious. This is the ice cream place, right? How would you like some delicious ice cream? Hey, Reyna, let's have some ice cream. Don't buy any. Sorry, Kettle, but eating too much cold food isn't good for your stomach. Well, not like anyone's gonna worry about me if I get sick. What are you talking about? What about your mom? Mom's never worried about a single thing that's happened to me. I thought he was gonna buy it. Kettle! Okay. Hey kids, would you mind playing with Kettle for a while? Kettle? Aw oh, man. I don't want to play with some rich kid. Oh, come on. That's no reason to say no. But that's what my mom told me. She said, don't play with that rich kid. My mommy said the same thing, too. Oh, fuck both your parents. But what does being rich have to do with who you play with? Kettle's been wanting to play with all of you for a long time. Don't you think that's what's important? Kettle? You really want to play with us? Yeah, I do. Well, too bad, nerd! Kicks him off the I always wanted to play top. with you, too. I was kind of wondering what you were like, too, Kettle. Well, great. Come on, Kettle. Go have some fun with them. But what about you guys? 
don't worry about us. We've got to catch a ship to get on with our journey. Thanks. Kill! Hey. Over here! Ha <laughs> yeah! It's nice seeing children play together, isn't it? I didn't realize you had a gentle side to you, Claude. By playing, Actually, you mean I'm standing around? I surprised myself. Anyway, we'd better get back to the business at hand. Shall we get going? Hi. Hey, you again. I think we're about to shove off. Good. Oh, really? Yep, sorry to keep you waiting. I got one more piece of cargo to load up, so if you got anything to buy or check up on one last time, go do it now. All right. Huh. Did you feel that? No. It's just so nice to be here, no matter what time of the year. It certainly is, isn't it? There it is again! Ah! Well, you should have listened. Ah! Well, they're all dead. What was that about? So hard to imagine? Well then, um... Yeah. Oh, Tria, please save us all. Oh, Tria, please save us all. That earthquake must have been right below us. Where's the earthquake? Now the this tidal wave. It's the end of cure. All my treasures got taken away by that wave. My shop! Oh, my shop! Why did this happen to us? Whew, thank God I managed to save all my limited edition... Ken Nee Comet. A huge came wave came out of nowhere and took everything away. Kettle. Kettle, you're all right. Hey, lady. Where are your friends? I could only find one of them. I oh. the boy. What about your mother? Is she safe? The lady of the house was out of town when the earthquake struck. She should be fine. That's good to hear. Hey, lady. Yes? Stop calling me lady. I'm glad you're okay, too. Well, thank you. Oh, dear. Has anyone seen my husband? That earthquake killed my entire crew. It's a miracle I managed to survive. My crepe shop gone forever. I haven't talked to everyone yet. Fine. Oh, thank heavens you're safe, Captain. Yeah, nothing short of a miracle, actually. But my crew's gone, uh, save for that guy over there. That guy. That was quite a shock, I have to say. That bizarre wind and then that horrible rumbling. What wind? So what are you going to do now? A whole lot of nothing is what I'm going to do. Can't do much without a ship. Let me give you a word of advice, though. You know I'm not the only way to get to L, right? Oh. You're not? Nope. First off, let me give you your royal travel permit back. 
Okay. Now take that permit with you to the Lacour continent. If you ask the king over there nicely, I bet he can arrange for a ship to take you to L. Lacour? Cool. Kind of out of your way, I know. But if you ask me, that's your best bet. You'll need to go through Harley first, though. That's a port city on the eastern edge of Cross. Okay. To Harley first, then. You'll know you're going the right way if you see a village called Mars. Yeah, I've already Mars seen that. It's kind of out of the picture right now. So Mars is going to be the best place to stock up and get a good night's sleep before the voyage. Mars. Okay. You still seriously want to go to L after all this? You guys must be crazy. Yeah. Never claimed to be sane. The sorcery globe control nature too, or is it something else? I wonder if Kettle is okay. We've taken quite the detour, but we should be grateful that none of us were harmed. All right. Well, before we go to Kel or Mars, rather, what the fuck is that over there? See that, right? Hey, I think we can do some fishing here. Oh, oh bullshit! It's over. All right. Already. We're gonna have to get our meter back up, unfortunately. Ocean of Merlin. Oh, 100% MP heal. Okay. Um. The. Oh, what? Or... There we go. Cars. Oh, wait. Yep, let's fast travel to here. Because there's apparently a PA. Time limited. Wasn't he that three-eyed man we saw? You really came to meet me. I, I don't know. I just don't know. But there's something I have to tell you, no matter what. Clyde, there has never been anyone who can see right into my mind until you. Celine. What's more, the way your word reached straight into my heart. Huh. It was the first time anyone's been able to do this. I don't rem- Even without saying anything else. Just with that one word. Celine. Oh, what's happening to me, Clyde? I've never felt anything like this before. Oh. Don't run away from it, Celine. I want you to stay here, with me. Please. I need you to help me, Clyde. Oh my! Wow! Ring bells? The bell tolls to end this dream. But it doesn't matter to me anymore. Nothing else matters. Only this moment right now matters to me. Celine. Your Highness! Where have you been? Clearly, you can see where he's huh? been. You! Your Highness must come with us. Princess Rosaria is waiting for you. What's the meaning of this, Clyde? 
answer me, Clyde. Tell me that's not true. Celine, I I'm sorry. Why did you lie to me? I didn't mean to hide it from you. It's just that, well, I, I just couldn't find the courage to tell you. Please believe me. I can't. Please tell me this is all a lie or something. Please, Clyde. There is no Clyde, ma'am. The man before you is the Crown Prince of Cross, Prince Clouser T. Cross. Ah. Huh. No, I'm Clyde. Prince Clouser, what in heavens is the matter with you? On this day of your glorious wedding ceremony with Princess Rosaria, we find you here of all places. Oh, damn. The princess has worried herself sick over your sudden disappearance, your highness. Damn, not only did he lie about who he was to her. Celine! Oh. Burn him! Burn the countryside! This is all wrong. You have to believe me, Celine. Celine, they're going to take Clyde away. Reyna, are you <laughs> going to let it end like this, Celine? Huh. I mean, she doesn't really Let's have go. an option. Go? Go where? Where else? We're going after Prince Clouser. I mean, we're going after Clyde. I don't want to. But... I can't go see him now. I can't bring myself to do such a thing. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Is this what you want, though? If you let him go like this, you may wind up regretting it for the rest of your life. I mean, but... he's still an asshole. Um... I don't know. Sure. Let's go, Celine. Huh? You're coming along even if I have to drag you the whole way, Celine. If we don't go now, you're definitely going to regret it. I don't want to see that happen to you. So let's go, Celine. Celine! Oh, okay. I mean, I don't think there Stop was right there. Prince Clouser's wedding ceremony is currently underway. Don't you realize that? We have something to discuss with the prince himself. What? Look, just let us in. Burn him. Fire. <laughs> Hold it. Who are you? They're intruders. Stop them. Clyde! Do you, Rosaria R. Lacour, take Clouser T. Cross to be your lawfully wedded husband to have and to hold till death do you part? Let's see if we can get the prince to say I don't. No! He's too far away to hear us! I mean... Do you, Clouser T. Cross... That's not very far away. ...to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold, till death do you part. Especially if you're shouting. No! 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 Clyde! Clyde! Celine! Celine! Hey! Clyde! Clyde! And can we have more words used? Oh, Celine, I'll never let you go again. That princess is probably pissed. Rosaria. Would you mind explaining this to me, Prince? I feel terrible about this. But there's just no way I can love you. This marriage exists purely for the sake of political gain. Uh -huh. How am I supposed to love you like this? That's most princes and princesses. I'm really sorry, princess. But I just can't lie to myself any longer. 
Princess, what should we do about this? Kill him! I want you to make a beautiful wedding dress for her. Oh! Rosaria. Farewell, Prince Klauser. Damn. Princess. So, uh... Is Celine getting married here? Cut. Or should I say Prince Clauser? Clyde is better. Clyde, then. Celine, will you marry me? There, I finally said it. This is how I really feel. Please, what do you say? Will you? Say no! Say no! Is that a no? That's not it, but... But what? I made a promise to travel with Reyna. We still haven't accomplished anything yet. What are you talking about, Celine? You know we'll be okay even if you can't stay with us any longer. No, Reyna. I can't just leave as long as I haven't found the answer for myself yet. As it is now, I haven't come anywhere close to finding an answer I can be satisfied with. Listen, Clyde. Is it all right if we wait until after I've found my answer? I can hold you to that, right? Of course. Cute. I don't remember this PA at all. Are you sure about this, Celine? You're going to be farther away from each other than ever before. It's all right. It won't be painful for me any longer. Even if we're separated in body, our spirits are still together. I have to admit, I really envy you. Besides, what do you think would happen once I became a princess? That would certainly be the end of my adventuring days, for one. I'd like to enjoy this as much as I can, while it lasts. Huh. So that's why. Well, we know Claude and Celine aren't getting together. Oh, it's probably a Reina only private action, isn't it? Oh, okay, that's why the map wasn't working. I think that's good for this episode. Interesting way to end it. What's happening? I can hear a bunch of people shouting from the castle. Hey, <laughs> that's a secret. But yeah, hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, Esco Knights, share the love. Goodbye. <laughs>